Hey, welcome back to Ramseyland. Today I want to explore the refractive index of light through mineral oil and pyrex. Check this out. So all I'm using in this investigation is mineral oil, a small 50 milliliter beaker, and a larger 200 milliliter beaker. Begin by filling your 200 milliliter beaker with mineral oil. Okay, the second step is to take your smaller beaker and to slowly lower it into the mineral oil. And at first you'll be able to see the beaker. That's because there's air inside. So when light travels through two or more transparent mediums, it changes direction and it slows down. That's called refraction. So when light's traveling through air, it's going at about 300,000 kilometers per second. But when it hits this glass, it's more dense. And so it slows down to about 200,000 kilometers per second and it changes direction. So what would happen if the index of refraction for both the Pyrex and the mineral oil is the same? Let's find out. So I'm gonna lower it into the mineral oil. And right now I can see it. But let's let some of that oil come inside of it. Up. It's as though I can see the top half, but I can't see the bottom half. And it vanishes! I can't see it at all! And that's because the index of refraction for both the Pyrex and the mineral oil is the same. It's as though it becomes invisible. Let's take a closer look. Can you see another beaker inside? Can you see it on the bottom? Okay, now let's slowly lift it out. There it is. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> Well, I hope you enjoyed today's edition of Ramsey Land, and I'll see you next time.